There's a new edge to saving lives in Baton Rouge using state-of-the-art technology. It's called VR MedConnect, and you saw it first on News 2 about three months ago. Here are the facts first. It's a video and data link between EMS and local hospitals. It's a pilot program the mayor hopes will allow doctors to evaluate patients before they get to the emergency room. Baton Rouge is the second city in the nation to offer this service. And News 2's Christine Lewis gives us an inside look on how it works. We have an ETA approximately five to seven minutes. 54-year-old male, complaining of sudden onset of chest pain. What you're looking at is cutting-edge technology that could one day save your life. Cameras, computers, and video linked from this ambulance into an emergency room. All paramedics have to do is make one call and... Hello, EMS 7. This is Dr. Angler and all the way to the You've got a doctor virtually at your side. And with this technology, they're able to monitor the patient in ways never before seen. If the patient is able is, is getting worse, we can actually assist and, and watch what the EMT is able to do in the field. So we can assist them. 10-4, sir. Be advised. And if the patient does get worse... A patient's blood pressure dropped to 90 over 60, so that's around about 85 percent. And at this critical point, the doctor can provide life-saving treatment in real time. Let's go ahead and get him into the okay? It's all done with a touch of a button, and most folks agree. It's good knowing that there is a, a bridge that's been gapped between the ERs and the paramedics that are out in the field. Excellent. We'll see you when you get here. Christine Lewis, WBRZ, Balance News. It costs $25,000 to equip ambulances and another 30000 to install emergency rooms with this technology. Grants pay for the system.